monsters, horrible glass clowns. Yuck. Some Fenton. I'm just a girl, Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. Mark just honked the horn. We are in Kokomo in place. Another place we've never been before. The vendor out on a limb and assuming it's sort of like a, 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 a Trader Baker's, which is a big indoor flea market that I've gone to before. We don't know. We shall see. So let's go see what we can find today. Vendor City. Hey, y'all. That's what it says right there. Oh my word, that baby's a zombie. And so is that baby. Oh, we got baby zombies. We got bootleg Vuitton. Some shoes, but you know what? The beauty about places like this, there's a little green town. No, that's St. Clair, actually, it's $45. Is that there are treasures sometimes to be mingled in with the beanie babies and the knives. You never know, I have found lots of good things before at places like this. Oh, there's some DS games. Get to tell my husband. Mark, there's DS games. Look at those babies. A little crocheted boy and girl. That's a big bell there, Mark. Can I, can I buy it? No. Oh, but let's see. There's skeletons of critters, trains. No. Not, no, no, not real skeletons. They're pretend skeletons of critters. But there's some little grass, glass critters. There's horrible glass clowns. Yuck. Some Fenton. A little cart. We're gonna take it. Looks like it's all 90s. It's a little 90s cart. All right, here we got some fairy lamps. We got a little Fenton hobnail for 40, a little lithophane. The lithophane ones are seven. We got some Viking for 18. So, I mean, there's, there's some vintage in here. There sure is. A little Ellie Smith. So, yeah. Look at the Ewoks and Gizmo. Gremlin. He's cute. Not be at a flea market if you didn't see piles and piles of mattresses. Nope talk over the jazzy music that's going on in here. There's little Woodstock. He's vintage. He's $4.99. Some little redware. Brazil? No, doesn't say. But I think it's Brazil. Here's a little Poda. This is Lufton. It's just $7.99. But a lot of the petals are broken off. Oh my gosh, I remember these. Do you remember getting these at King's Island? Oh yeah. I had like yeah! Fruit, fruit Lemonade or fruit punch or something. That's funny. Kind of yeah. Lots of pudas, 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 pudas. Redware elephant. Little glass elephant there. We've got some more. Boy, really, somebody had a poodle and an elephant collection. This, you can buy targets if you need to. Like, you could get that guy and shoot that apple off of his head right there if you want. Perhaps you want to shoot the meerkats, which I, or prairie dogs, I guess, which I don't recommend. Canisters. Oh, Mickey. These are kind of cool. Different. There's some Belendo there for $9.99. Oh, she is real soon. Serious? There he is, Mickey Mouse. You know, I want to say, I think it's always a good idea if you have a booth at an at a antique mall or a vendor mall or flea market. Put your business card out. They had some brochures too, but you know, people, you never know. People might get a hold of you if they have a bunch of stuff that they want to get rid of. And they're like, you know, I'll, I'll call this person. They have their card right here. So it could definitely be a way that you could, um, you know, source for more inventory. And I was just telling um, Mark, you know, there has to be, you know, some of these flea markets, you know, there's probably things that, there's just treasures that we just just waiting to be found that's why I like flea markets so much because you know sometimes you can find things and sometimes you don't but it's always interesting just to see what you can find because maybe you'll find something really great I feel like we're in a rave with this music but like this little guy he is a dollar 35 oh shoot he's got a broken thing I like to find these little st. Patrick's Day pixies because you don't see them very often that would be cute too I wonder if the partner there's Ziggy I did find one thing and I'll show you in just a second it's in my cart on the other side of this aisle some little gooses burgers snowman 
There's a saxophone. That one's vintage. But I don't think it has its partner. It definitely doesn't go with the ice cream cone, but so we don't have the partners there. Um, but I did, let's look on this side. We've got some angels. Mm. But I did find, and I'm going to get it scraped for this time of year, this little wooden owl from the 1970s. It's $4.99. So that's the only thing I found so far. Um, no. We don't need to get you, but look at that. That is a crochet, no, a crochet needlepoint I don't know what that's called but look at that for 575 the first aid travel kit I mean I don't know that I want to do 575 for it but that's really cute so they have a little bit of a mixture in this booth Ooh, these are pretty these um, vintage light fixtures raggedy Ann's an old chair Let's see. It's over on this other side. I've got some vintage glasses. These are $1.25 each, and there are six of them. They're kind of stuck together. Here we go. Those are pretty. I don't know why this is triggering a memory for me. It's an advertisement for Duracell. It's $1.75. It's made by Applause. But uh, you so apparently it says you press Rudolph's nose and I light up. I mean, there, there's no batteries in it. I don't even know if it has a place to redo the batteries. But oh, but that's kind of interesting. I just it's like I'm having like a memory. <laughs> Let's see if it has a date. It's applause. Hmm. I don't know, but there isn't a place to put batteries in him. All right, I just did a comp on eBay. There's none, there's a, several listed, but none for sale. But I don't know, it's just, I was having a moment with you, Rudolph. Okay, here's another moment. Isn't this Sarah? Wasn't that her name? Remember what her name was? Like Sarah, the dinosaur. I'm getting her. I'm having a moment with her. Sarah, she's a little puppet. They had a whole bunch of all the characters from um, Land, Before Time. Land Before Time. This is the kind of stuff that I look. I love looking through this kind of stuff. It's a bag of babies for five dollars, though. But that one, that one's cute right there. She's a cute one. There's a little moccasin. Mark, there's a bunch of cars here. Mark will have to look through the cars, but oh, there's Barney. It's Barney. I want to get a few of these that are a dollar. Like, I almost got that one, but it's two dollars. But I like her. And then there's, um, no, I'm sorry. You're, you're a witch, but I like this one. She's my favorite witch. But, like, some of these things will be cute. I don't know. I just have memories of some of these little toys. Look, this is Strawberry Shortcake. She's a... Um, like a newer strawberry shortcake doll. I don't know who she is. Mark will look through those cars, but what do you see over here, Mark? Yeah. Oh, there's little things in here. Middlebury, Indiana. Here's another coal bear made from coal. Or I guess that's an owl, not a bear. Mm, little home coal. There's a little owl there from... I don't know where that owl is from. Bean sprouts or cows. There's one in every bar. Horses behind. It's a little glass turtle for five. Oh my gosh, what are you, little sailor? Your little peanut. Your little peanut sailor. Your two dollars. Oh, he's got a little butt. Babies, look at those plungers with the poop poop on them. That little eraser, those googly eyes. See, this is the kind of stuff I could just get lost in just looking at all of these little smalls. <gasps> Look at the Smurf school bus. It's $10. That's fun. What's going on here? I don't get it. I don't under, like some of these are all little 
I don't quite understand. Like they're getting their hair cut and back home again in Indiana, Peyton Manny, Reggie Miller, and Bob Knight. They're getting their hair cut. Okay. I mean, some of them are pretty self-explanatory though, I guess. Aw, rest in peace, Dale. That's a glare. Dale, Dale Jr. Oh, these are cute. They're little salt and pepper shakers. They say they're from Fort Wayne, Indiana. Well, that's what someone wrote that on the bottom. But they're $6. They're made in Japan. They've got their little collars on. They're kind of like a little clown elephants, but I think I'm going to get them. I think they're cute. I was looking at this little squeaker tall. She, doll. She's cute. She's $8.99. Then I looked down. I was like, oh, there's a fairy lamp. It is a clear glass one. It's made by HomeCo. It's $9.49. It is in their original box, but I'm going to, I mean, I'm going to get it. It's, see, it's just the, there's the man in his cart. It's just the clear glass. I'm going to have him take it out just to make sure it's not broken anywhere, but because it, it looks like it's, I mean, it has a candle in it, so it looks like it's been used, but let's see. Mr. Potato Head. Is it looking good? Oh my gosh, look at that disc CD changer. <laughs> I haven't seen one of those in a long time. Looks good. Looks Pretty. good? Yeah, we'll have to clean it, but yeah. $9.50. We'll, 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 we'll try it. Well, we are leaving Vendor City. I couldn't remember what the name of it was. I mean, it's a flea market. You're going to have moments where you might find some treasures and you might not. And that's okay. It's kind of fun. We had fun kind of walking around and laughing at things that kind of brought back memories and stuff. So it's all in a good time and I was able to get a few things for resale. So I, oh, and Mark got some license plates. I didn't get that on camera but he was happy he got some 1930s. 1930s license plates for five dollars so i mean that was a pretty good deal you never know what you're going to find at the flea market you just never know so thank well, you guys. hello friends and i thought i would go ahead and add to the end of this video some friend mail unboxing oh i gotta get my scissors okay i got my scissors now i have one two three four five wait three four five six packages and a card so the first little card here is from Linda Linda Lee she lives in Texas oh fun for Misty from Linda oh my gosh so she sent this little and I like that you didn't um, sign the card because I can reuse the card Linda but she sent me some stickers see fun for Misty Stickers are fun for Misty. Little Christmas stickers. We got Merry Christmas. We got a little elf. We got another little elf that says Merry Christmas. He's be great for package shoppers. A little Santa. Ooh. Look at the little vintage inspired deer. And Santa and deer. Well, those are cute, Linda. I really appreciate that. Thank you so very much. How thoughtful and kind. I really, really appreciate that. Very, very sweet. This next one is from Candace. She lives in Michigan. Michigan. I love Michigan. All right, so let's see. And I, I've had these sitting over here for a while. I'm sorry, I'm just now getting to them. Sometimes I walk right past them and I don't, I, I'm just, just trying to get stuff done. So I'm sorry I'm just now opening these. All right, so this is from Candace, who is vintage show and tell. It says, hi, Misty, you are amazing and I love your YouTube channel. I've been watching since 2020. Thank you, Candace. I could not resist to pick this little gift up for you. I hope it amuses you and makes you smile. Keep it or pass it on as you wish. Thank you for all you do. Vintage show and tell, Candace. All right, oh my gosh. Well, I'm gonna save the bubble wrap. Here we have a little box. From Herburgers. Herb Herburgers. I said that completely wrong. There's Candace's letter. You've got nice handwriting, Candace. Oh my gosh! Well, I'm gonna put these on because I don't even have any earrings in. Look! I got babies! 
They're baby earrings. Do you know, I probably would freak a few people out wearing these. They probably look at me like, who is that crazy lady with the babies on her ear? But I'm going to wear them for the remainder of this video. I'm just letting you know. Thank you, Candace. Little baby for my ears. I appreciate it. All right, this next one is from Linda from Alabama. All right, ooh, this is reminding me of Liberace. He would put a little gift in that bag. All right, so Linda, she made a call. Oh my gosh, how cute! Look at the cat! That is an angry little cat. I like him. All right, this says, hello Misty, as a lurker, I wanted to let you know I enjoy and appreciate you. I have three other lurker sisters that agree. Aw! Um, I love earrings, too, so I thought I would send you some. Uh-oh, babies are going to have some competition. I thought I would send you some. I have made. One of my sisters just had her first whatnot sale with jewelry she makes. You've inspired us to dry to sell on that platform. Keep up the good work. Bye for now. Linda from Alabama. Aw. Okay. I'm going to have to rotate earrings. So, oh, look at this. Possum. That's cute. I'm so glad that you decided to sell on Whatnot. It's a fun, fun platform. I absolutely love it. All right. Oh, wow. Oh, cute. Look at the little cat, the little hearts with the little cat paws. Those are adorable. Oh my gosh, look at these little gingerbread mans. Those will be cute for Christmas. Ooh, I like these. Well, I'll rotate my earrings out. These are like little leaves. And they've got little a little gem. All right, we're going to take out babies. I'm going to stand bait. See, the cool thing about those is that I can, they stand up. So I can put them in a display, which I might do. I might put them in the display behind me. I like them. I might, people might look at me a little strange if I wore the gingerbread men right now. Because people are like, it's not even September. Well, no, it's September now. But slow down with Halloween. Well, thank you very much, Linda. I keep the cards aside and like this little guy I'll reuse. I appreciate these. Thank you so much. I love them. And I'm so happy that you're selling on whatnot. It's a fun platform. All right. Ooh. This is from Sandy. My flipping van life. Speaking of speaking of whatnot, my flipping van life is amazing. Now, Sandy, did I did I buy this from you? Oh my gosh, it's pretzel. Well, it looks like pretzel. Sandy's dog. It oh! Pretzel! Pretzel! Pretzel sent me a gift! Pretzel you shouldn't have. Shouldn't have pretzel. What do you got? Okay. Pretzel sent me some la a laxative tablets. Pretzel knows me so well. No, I do like these. I put them on my shelf in my bathroom. That's a cute little size, too. It is... Uh, nature's Remedy Laxatives for conditions caused by or associated with the constipations. So cute, right? That's going to go home. Thank you, Pretzel. All right, we have three more boxes. This one is from the Karen Radford. She told me I didn't have to open it on, on camera, but I am anyway, Karen. Karen is a fellow Hoosier. She lives in Indiana. Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. What's this? Country roads take me home to the place I belong. I love it. I love this color, too. Country roads take me home. I like that, Karen. Here we got a little something else. You know I love me some t-shirts. Love a graphic t-shirt. Speaking of... I got my merch on. If you're interested in some uh, stay weird and unusual merch, uh, you can go to thrifterjunkervintagehunter.com and you can order one if, if you like. Oh, wow. Karen, this is beautiful. 
Oh my gosh, this is made out of old pottery. I love this kind of stuff. Look at this necklace. And it would go so good with this shirt. So these are broken pieces of pottery of a plate that someone has created this art with. This is the other side. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, wow. So you could wear this necklace really going either way, which is kind of nice. You can just do the plain side or the side with the paints on it. That is really cool. Karen, thank you so much. Wow. I love that. And I love this shirt too. That's beautiful, Karen. Thank you so very much. I love that. I love stuff like that. I love jewelry that people have made. I just do. Okay, so this is this next one is from Tammy. And she is in Oh Canada. That was horrible, but Tammy's in Canada. Tammy, I, there's potato chips in here, Candy. Tammy, they are squished. Ooh, I see something. Some kind of snack in here. Oh, wow. Oh, oh. Okay, so Tammy. Well, in here, we've got some cookbooks. Your Frigidaire recipes. Is there a card? Okay. I don't see a card. I don't see a card. But we've got, make sure it didn't go inside the book. We've got your Frigidaire recipes. Robin Hood. Oh, there is a card. Cakes and icings. Oh, that looks like a big ding dong or a ho-ho. Do you know those little hostess cakes? Okay, so we do have a card. Oh, I love that one for Halloween decoration. Speed cooking with your General Electric range. When you buy a new oven and stuff, they don't come with stuff like this anymore. All kinds of helpful hip tips and hints in that cookbook, but I don't think they do that anymore. All right, so here is a card from Tammy. Oh, I love it. Tammy made this card. That's pretty. Misty, I found this, well, there's a pixie in here somewhere. This little pixie while garage sailing. He was only 25 cents. Can you believe it? It's not my thing, but I know you like him. I am Tammy from Moments in Time by Tammy. I sent you a necklace made from broken dishes a while back. I've been making keychains too. I thought you might like one. Absolutely. I'm including an extra piece. Thought you might like to either gift it to someone or throw it in on one of your live sales. Yes, I'll do it as a giveaway. Always enjoy watching your videos. You're so quirky and cute. I, I highly, that's a huge compliment. I love quirky and I mean, who doesn't like being called cute? Um, take care of yourself. Keep smiling. P.S. I'm calling the cheat the keychains, my dish ran away with the spoon. I found the cutlery keychains, already made it a garage sale, and just added some embellishments. And she even makes a card. Yes, well, I'll look at, well, when we open these up, Tammy, I'll do them as a giveaway. So we've got Werther's Originals, classic. We love those. Oh, wait, we got the caramel ones, too. Yum. Love those. And then what are these? Little bookmarks. I wonder if you, I bet you Tammy made these. Look at the little bird, the paper craft, and it's on a paper clip. So cute. And here we've got some little, have you tried squirrel peanut butter? Like little, um, little cards or certificate. Those are cute. There's a couple bags of those. So those are cute. Those would be cute little package toppers right there. Spread the joy. Okay, here. Oh, yes. Now, Tammy also made me that necklace, and then she made one for Barb. And I'm I'm going to get getting ready to give it to her this weekend because I'll see her this weekend. Moments in Time by Tammy. You can find her on Facebook and Instagram. Look at the keychains. So, she said that she found the keychains at a yard sale and added the embellishments. And there's a little piece of pottery that she added to that. Isn't that neat? And then we have another one. Well, I will keep one and I will do one as a giveaway. Isn't that so neat? All right, and so this is a necklace. I love these. Oh, wow. Okay, so see, it's a little necklace with a pottery with the bumblebee on it. 
Isn't that so clever? I love it. And then this is the little the little pixie that she said she found at a yard sale for a quarter. He is a little black leotard pixie. Great for Halloween. Oh my gosh. We'll put him right here next to E.T. First of all, have you seen this? I just got this. And I just got that at the antique mall. It's an ET. It's a ceramic ET. But his little I put a little witch hat up, but it keeps falling off. But we're gonna put little pixie guy right there next to ET. Tammy, thank you so much. That was very oh wait, no wait. She also sent me some candy. Snacks of Kit Kats, Coffee Crisp, Smarties, which I have found are much better than M&M's. Those little Smarties. And a arrow, peanut free. So some snacks from Canada. They've got the best snacks. Thank you so much, Tammy. I really appreciate that. That's awesome. And then we're gonna spread the love because we're gonna do one of your items um, as giveaways. All right, so this one is from Ladybug. Ladybug GTV, California. This is the last box. Hi, Misty. There is another note inside this, but I just realized I did not sign it. This is from Maria, a.k.a. Ladybug GTV. eBay, Instagram, and whatnot. Okay, so we got... This is packaged so nice, too. Oh, my gosh. <gasps> you guys! It's little Cupid and a doodle dog. Hey, there! Oh my word, that is precious. Here's the card, let me read what it says. Hi Misty, I love your video vlogs especially. I'm sending you some babies to add to your collection. I wish here in California we had such an abundance of a really cool vintage um, itself as you do. I love art glass, mostly Ellie Smith in blue. I'm a reseller too. I wish I could have the courage to do a YouTube channel and be able to sell, to sell live. Uh, I hate myself on video. Listen, it's freeing in many aspects. I was the same way. And since doing it, it's, I've become much more comfortable in my own skin. So there's that. Um, thank you for your content and inspiration. Oh my gosh. That is adorable doodle dog right there next to little cupie and i love the green oh my gosh that's precious that is precious maria and then oh happy days are here again this is little toopie Nev new old stock whoops happy days are here again the little cupie little cupie collector's plate that's adorable. Oh my gosh. These are the Rose O'Neill. Um, and you can see Rose O'Neill down there. This is adorable. Genuine porcelain. I love that. Oh my gosh. This is so happy. Happy, happy, happy. Oh my gosh, Maria. Thank you so much. Thank you guys so much for sending me things. Oh, <laughs> look at that. No clowns. No clowns allowed. Thank you, Maria. I really do appreciate it. And thank you guys for sending me items. You never have to do it. I'm so sorry that it's taking me so long to just do, to open them, but I do try to get it on video and sometimes it just gets away from me. But I do really appreciate you guys so, so much. I hope that you realize that and know that I, I'm, I'm, I'm so thankful. I'm so thankful. Thank you so much. Thank you for also watching the flea market shop along. Flea markets are always fun or vendor malls. You just never know what you're going to find in there. That's kind of the beauty of it. Mark and I have such a fun time when we are going in and looking at these like random things. And sometimes you can really find a lot of good stuff. So don't rule them out. They're kind of fun just to go in and see what all is there. Some days it's good. Some days it's not so good. So check out your local vendor mall. You never know what you're going to find. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. And I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Red hot mama, red hot mama. You're the one we need. Red hot mama, some charmer. Yes, indeed. You say that I should be in the follies. Hot tamales.
say that I got a pair of eyes just like old Sven Valley's. I confess that I possess the sweetest charms in town. And unless I miss my guess, the boys all follow me around. I could make a music master, drop his fiddle, make a bald head, a man, part his hair in. 